Hi, I'm Jim Hendricks, and today I'm aboard the Wellcraft 352. This boat is built for serious fishing as well as luxurious family cruising, and I'm going to show you some of the great features, starting with this tower and second station where you can drive the boat. The second station on our boat was equipped with virtually all the features you'll find on the main helm, including a Garmin GPS 12-inch display, Mercury outboard piloting joystick control, a binnacle control, a Mercury vessel view display, controls for the trim tabs, and a VHF radio. As I mentioned earlier, the Wellcraft 352 is also designed for luxurious family cruising, and that's reflected in the bow seating and the bamboo dinette. The family's gonna love this. The 352 is also equipped with a forward lounger with a large cooler underneath. The family features aboard the Wellcraft 352 extend into the aft cockpit with two bench seats. You can take a seat whether you're fishing or just out for a day cruise, and they're easy to put up and take down. Our boat is equipped with a freshwater sink and faucet. The boat also features a live well in the transom that's standard, but this one came equipped with an optional chiller. It's a 12 volt powered chiller. If you want to use this as a cooler, it minimizes the need for ice and keeps your drinks and other provisions nice and chilly. The Wellcraft 352 comes equipped with an inward opening dive door. Now, this makes it convenient for boarding or disembarking from floating docks. It also helps tremendously when you get lucky enough to land a big tuna or swordfish. What I really like about this boat is the prep station. Now it's covered, which offers a nifty step up to the tower, but you can lift it up to reveal a cutting board. There's also a cool refrigerator. Finally, there's a really cool live well. This is my favorite seat in the house, the helm seat. The Wellcraft 352 features three across seating, each one with a flip-up bolster and fold-down armrests. In addition, the center helm seat drops away completely so you can stand while you're piloting the Wellcraft. This is one of the most nicely appointed helms I've seen. It features twin Garmin 22-inch multifunction displays. The binnacle controls help you harness in the power of the triple Mercury 400R Verados. That's 1,200 horsepower, and it's capable of pushing this boat to speeds in the high 50s. There's also power steering and Mercury's outboard joystick control that lets you maneuver the boat and dock it in very tight quarters. Now this boat's also equipped with a Seakeeper 3. It's a gyro stabilization system that helps control the roll of the boat and keep it extremely comfortable. The Wellcraft 352 was designed with a superbly smooth riding hull that knocks big seas down to size. It also handles exceedingly well, carving turns with precision and confidence. On those days when you're lucky enough to catch a bunch of fish, this boat will handle them with two huge insulated, macerated fish boxes under the aft deck. This may be a center console boat, but that doesn't mean it doesn't have a cabin. In fact, there's a roomy cabin accessed by a side door that allows the side window to swing open for easier access. Inside, you'll find a sink with fresh water, a flush toilet, and a berth for the kids or those days when you want to overnight. And to make it comfortable all day long, our boat's equipped with a Fusion audio system. This is a premium system with six JL speakers and a subwoofer. In addition, there's RGB lighting. That might not attract a lot of fish, but it'll attract a lot of friends. Leave no doubt, Wellcraft's 352 is a serious offshore fishing machine, but it also features luxury appointments and comfort that everyone can appreciate when cruising and relaxing on the water.